Good morning, everybody. I am Jess with Jess's Magical Memoirs, and I am back with another plan with me for you today. I feel like it's been a while since we've done a plan with me, so really excited to get into this one. This is the last week of summer. Oh my gosh, the kids go back to school next week. So we're doing a really fun final like summer spread. I'm really excited. If you want to see how I'm planning for this week, stick around because that's coming up right now. <laughs> Okay, Planny fam, welcome back. And like I said, this is the last week of summer and I am doing a plan with me for that week. It is the week of August 21st through August 27th. The kids go back to school next week. Just, just crazy. I decided to do a really fun summer spread to kind of go out with a bang for the summer. And we are going to be using the Live Love Posh Beach Babe sticker book. And I have been wanting to use these stickers all summer long and I kept forgetting about it. And I was like, you know what? This is like the perfect way to go out this summer. They're just super bright, super fun. Uh, lots of doodly stickers. It is kind of like last minute getaway road trip type, type vibes. And even though we're not going anywhere, I still really wanted to do this as a spread. But there's also some like really fun stickers and this one, like we have this really cool, like which way you gonna go? Um, we've got the reminder on the cell phone. We've got some like really fun, like doodly stickers. Babe, please just chill out for like two seconds. This is really cute. I probably won't use um, like any of like the traveling things. I, I don't know if I'll use the car, maybe, maybe not. I haven't really figured that out yet, but we also have some like books and bags and like I love the crocs just like fun doodly stuff too which I thought was really was really fun to use for this spread I'm also going to be pairing it with a few different boxes um, I do want to pull a little bit of black in so I have my black boxes sticker book as well um, but I think we're going to focus on pink and yellow I'm not going to focus on the blue I feel like I've done a lot of blue lately um, so I'm really going to go with the the yellow and pink vibes with this like baby pink color and then we'll just add a touch of black in there as well i still have to pick out my highlighter colors and my washi tape so i'm gonna go pull all of that and then i will be back and we can get started okay so i picked out my markers for my highlighting and my washi tape i'm gonna use this really fun um simply gilded washi tape it's got that pink and yellow and then the blue and it's got a silver foil in it but it's okay i think it'll be fine and then I picked out this like baby pink and this bright highlighter yellow color. I think that's all going to go really well. And I am just going to start. I'm going to talk to you guys about what's going on the next upcoming couple of weeks. Um, talk about the trip a little bit. I want, I almost want to put my box in over here first. I think I want to do, do I want to do yellow or pink? I don't want to do black. I don't want to do too much black. Looks like I only have pink. Let's go with pink then. I guess we're going with pink. It's fine. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to talk to you guys. This past weekend um, was kind of all about the family. We, um, we just did like a bunch of like family things together. Whoops prepping for school for the kiddos and it's a little crooked but that's what it is um yeah prepping for school we I just kind of I needed this past weekend to decompress a lot because my anxiety I can just feel it rising today it's Monday by the way um, yeah, it's because of everything that's coming up. And I really just wanted this past weekend to be nice and relaxing, both for me and my husband and for the kids. And I'm really glad that I was able to accomplish that this past weekend. We ended up going to my dad's on Saturday, had a final pool day, and my sister got everybody lunch, which was super sweet. And then yesterday, Sunday, we, uh, me, my daughter, and my mom went to Rentham and did a bunch of back to school shopping for the kids and she actually um gave uh, got me my my crocs not my crocs i'm so sorry my converses for our upcoming disney trip i was i was really really grateful for her for that because she didn't have to do that 
I was planning on getting them myself and then money hiccups. So I was, you know, you know, I was sacrificing me for my daughter. Um, that's just what us moms do. And, um, my mom was like, I can't let you do that. I'm going to get you yours too. And she was just super sweet about it and super great about it. Love her for that. So just had like a really nice weekend. She got us lunch and it was just a really nice weekend. I really needed it to kind of prep my body and my mind going into the next couple of weeks. All right, before I go on any further, do I want to do my box, my other boxes first, or do I want to do the deco? I guess I should do the boxes first. Um, I think for these two days, I'm going to put a box this way. I'm thinking the pink because we need to balance that out. So yeah, this week, I hope, yeah, that's the right one. Uh, this week, my daughter has a hair appointment and I told her that she could have one more sleepover. She was supposed to have one yesterday, last night into today, but that didn't work out. So I did promise her one more sleepover. So I have to, I still have to figure that out for this week. I'm not sure when that's going to happen. I don't know if it's going to be tonight or tomorrow night, but that's going to be somewhere uh, as well. But we have that going on, my daughter's hair appointment. And then my son, uh, Colin, this is his last full week of football practice. So from Monday through Thursday. And then next week, I'm not sure if he's going to have practice a full rest of next week too, or if it's just going to be Tuesday and Thursday, I think we'll find that out this week because technically they're supposed to go, um, they're supposed to start Tuesday and Thursdays only on the 30th. So I'm wondering if maybe he is, he is actually going to have Monday and Tuesday practice and then off Wednesday and then Thursday. I'm not sure yet. So hopefully the coach can figure that all out for us, but this is like officially his full his last full week of football practice. He also has his first game on Sunday, so that's really exciting. It is a preseason game, but um, but that's fine. I I'm a little worried. It looks like they're going to practice for an hour before every game, and uh, that concerns me a little bit. You know, they're you know, Colin's a little kid, and they're all little kids, and it just it just feels like a lot for them. And I hope he doesn't get burnt out. I'm really really hoping that he doesn't get burnt out. All right, I think I'm gonna do a yellow box here and a yellow box here. I just need to make sure I have the right sizes. I don't know if I do, shoot. I could use these ones and do more deco this week. I was trying not to do too much deco this week, but I'm gonna put this one here. <gasps> what is that? There's. Oh, that's from last week. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what is that? Oh, no. We'll just have to cover that up with a sticker. Um, I think I'm going to put this here. Like that. And then we're going to put this on. It's like super early in the morning. I'm just going to put it up here. Yeah, his game is at 9 but they want them there for an, a pra for practice an hour early, so 8 a.m. 8 a.m. Be there at 8 a.m. Such an early game. Okay, so those are my yellow boxes and those are my pink boxes. And then I think for my black boxes, what I might do is, I think I have some square ones. So maybe what we'll do is to balance out the sizes, we'll take two of these. just to balance that out. And then because I think my daughter's going to sleep over her friend's house tomorrow. That's what I think is the plan. I am going to put this. I wonder, I almost wonder if I should overlap this. You know what? We'll put it up here. It's fine. If it's off on the time, it's off on the time. And then these are down here. And then I think I'm going to put this one like over here and then I don't know but I'm thinking maybe on this day I don't know if I want to do like one more last hurrah thing with the kids or if I just want to like run errands this day but I have to figure that out but I I think I'm gonna try and accomplish something on Thursday we'll figure that out as we go all right so 
Uh, yeah, we, um, I don't know, do I want to put more washi tape here? No, I think I'm good. Let's highlight. So this week we have like back to school prep going on. That's basically what this week is. Just taking care of all that, doing some laundry and cleaning and that kind of thing, getting the kids all together for school. And then next week, I think I'm going to go back to dashing a little bit. I have a court hearing um, with my ex. Yay. Didn't think I was going to be here after 12 years, but here we are. Um, it's mostly just child support stuff, y'all, but I, I, I'm nervous that because um, just because of who he is, he might make it out to be more than it has to be. I'm hoping he doesn't. Hoping he'll pleasantly surprise me, but I don't know. So that's got me super anxious this week. So I've got that going on next Monday. And then I also got invited to a virtual first look of the new Disney cruise ship treasure through Disney Parks blog. I don't know if other people got this invite or not, but I, I'm going to take the opportunity and go with it. So that is actually the first day that the kids go back to school. So I have that for an hour next week. And I'm also just like starting to like go into hardcore Disney prep mode. We only have 35 days left. Crazy. Our last payment is due this Friday. Oh, I have to add that in there too. Um, so yeah, just, just a crazy, a crazy week, a crazy week coming up. So it's just a lot. All right. I need to, let's get some deco. Let's get, let's get into our deco boxes. Actually, you know, before I do that, let me speed you guys up and write these boxes in real quick. Now that I have those all written in, I am going to dig into this sticker book now. I kind of been going back and forth with if I wanted to do um, clear or paper. Um, I still haven't really fully decided yet. I think I want to do the Crocs in clear. So we have these. So why don't you guys tell me down below in the comments, like, are your kids already back to school? When are they going back? Or when did they go back? Um, how are you guys feeling? Like all of my fellow moms or dads, um, like, how are you all feeling about all of it? Like, I feel like I'm kind of like, I don't know. I feel like I'm kind of a mess. <laughs> Not like super sad about it. Like I'm kind of ready to have my time to do what I need again, need to again, but like a mess as in like just all over the place and like really behind that kind of thing is what I mean. All right. That's super cute. I'm glad I went with clear on those. And then I'm kind of thinking, do I want clear on that like sign? I was thinking of putting that sign here. I think maybe clear might be the way to go on this one. Like right here. And I think I'm just gonna put it like right in the middle. Let it like do its thing. 
so cute. Okay. And then I think I'm going to put the phone as clear too. And I think that it might be it for clear. This is kind of the same color as this though. I don't know how I feel about that. Should we put the phone up here instead? Maybe I should put it here. Yeah, I kind of like that. And then there is this candle. It says, girl, you need to calm the F down, which is kind of my life right now. <laughs> and I think I need to use it. Plus it's got the white. It's got the white. You need to calm down. <laughs> Just needs to think of Taylor Swift. I think I want to go here. Yeah. That's cute. All right. Now, I do think I want that, like, that bag over here. I just, I, I don't know if I want to use clear or paper. This is the paper one. Maybe we should do the Froyo. If I put this here, that's that color, though. Okay, let's put this there. And then this just, like, right over that, like that. That's kind of cute. And then what we can do is put a paper sticker here in between these two. Um, I just have to decide which paper sticker I want. I kind of want to use the books. The problem is, is it's huge. It's too big. I really wanted to use the books in this one, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. The book stickers are really big, y'all. I feel like there needs to be something else there. I'm gonna put this there. And we're gonna get something else for right there. I think I wanna use this sun kiss sticker. I'm only going off. I'm going off now. Okay, we're gonna go over the Crocs with that sun kiss sticker. I'm kind of leaning towards the Chanel Paris bag. I think that's what I'm thinking. That, the two bags there. Kind of leaning towards these. Let's see if I can get them to fit. That's kind of cute. All right, I want to get the pouches. Got this. I do think we need to add a little bit of blue in, but. Let's put this here and we'll put these here and we're going to get a little bit of blue. We're going to put, I think I'm just going to put this one just straight on like this. And then do we get the blue Chanel bag or like the seize the day? like a spa mask. Like that. That's really cute. All right, I'm almost wondering if we need some black quotes. I kind of feel like we need some black quotes. So let's move to the back. Yeah, these. Um, This one we could probably do I have one that says like wild, barefoot, and free. I feel like that would look really cute here. Um, and then I think we're just going to go ham on these quotes. Sunrise, sunburn, sunset, repeat. It's just a matter of getting it off. I think this will fit here. Here we go. And then we're gonna need one here and we're gonna need one here. I think that that's really cute. I'm almost tempted to put another one down here, but, <coughs> excuse me, I don't know if I should. Like this Live Love Beach. It's kind of cute. We can pull it and see what it'll look like. I 
I don't know. I'm not sure if I like that. I have an idea. That's cute. I know I still don't have like a black sticker down there. I'm gonna do something. Try and get some more black on this side over here. I don't know if it's gonna work, y'all. But we're gonna go for it. I'm just gonna move this over. And then it's gonna be a lot of collaging. Because I don't have anything else smaller. But you know, I just feel like that's too much right am I right like I'm right so it's just gonna have to be it's just gonna have to be okay just gonna have to be okay I think okay we have this page with flowers on it so I'm just gonna pull all these do I want to do paper or do I want to do clear maybe we should do clear it's gonna be harder to get off <laughs> okay you know what we're gonna do we're just gonna do a mix I'm just gonna do a mix I still feel like I need another black thing, but <laughs> there's just nothing for me to use. All right, y'all, I think I found something. I found a pair of sunglasses. There. I know it's so silly of me, but that totally fixed this for me. This is just how my eye works. <laughs> it's just, it's just how I work, y'all. Okay, so I am done with the last spread of summer. I can't believe that I have no more spreads after this. This is officially my last summer spread in my classic catch-all for this year, and that's crazy to me. I love how it came out. I think it came out so cute. I definitely am happy that I used these stickers for the last spread. A lot of my spreads, I feel like this, this summer specifically, have been very, like, hippies, 50s, 60s vibes. I don't know why. It's just where I've been at. It's just been my vibe, y'all, this summer. So I love it. I think it came out really, really cute. It's kind of hitting me that this is the last week of summer. Like, this is it. The kids go back to school. The chaos begins. Not that it hasn't already, but it's crazy. It's all kind of hitting me today. It's just one of those days today. After I finish the spread, I'm actually going to go chill and edit and start watching Gilmore Girls. Like this is it. This is officially time to get the vault, the fall vibes going. It's crazy. I hope you guys really liked this plan with me. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. It really, really does help out my channel, y'all. I know I've been changing things up a lot lately and I'm going to continue to do that, but I, I think it, I think it's paying off. I feel like it is. I also feel a lot happier doing things this way. So I hope you guys are still enjoying the content. Let me know down in the comments if there's anything else more that you would like to see from me. And I will try to get back to you. And I will look into that. I'll add some more ideas to my brainstorming list. If you're new here, thank you so much for watching. I would love it if you joined my planning fam by hitting the subscribe button down below. And don't forget that bell notification too so you don't miss any more of my future videos. All right, guys, that's it. Until the next video, happy planning and stay magical. Bye.